Hello, my name's Justin. I'm going to find a secondary use for a can of beer. We're going to make a pinhole camera out of a beer can. Hopefully, this can opener will work. Yes, it will. That, and opening it that way, apart from pouring water all over the floor, gives a lovely clean edge so you don't slice your finger off. <gasps> April Fool. Then you get a piece of card, chop notches. Those are notches and a piece of card. Don't cut your finger off like I just did then. God, it'll be exciting. Here we go. Loads of bits of card. Notches. Don't worry about how many, how much, how deep or anything. Notches. Notches. Very easy. Can. Upside down. Then you cut a really bad circle. It's like a clean hairdresser. Bad circle. Then you learn how to tear gaffer tape. Fantastic stuff. Oh, I love gaffer tape. Where would we be without gaffer tape and cable ties? If Leonardo da Vinci had gaffer tape and cable ties, think of what he'd invented. He could have invented the cable tie. You stick the card onto there, lift it up, crease this downwards to the horizontal. That goes on there. Badly cut circle goes on top. Three bits of tape. One, that way. I'm doing this very badly, just to show you that like it can even work when you do it really badly. And that one down there. Last bit of gaffer, just because it is great fun to tear. Right round the top. Com sa. Take that off. Put it over the top end. Then the dangerous bit. <gasps> Make a hole. Take it out. That's the maths done. Get your insulation tape that I can't find. Ooh, there's some. Uh, insulation tape, make yourself a shutter by folding sticky tape onto itself, putting it over the hole. Pinhole camera, fantastic. Then we need to put the photo paper in. What we've got in here is some light sensitive photographic paper. Now, you don't need to have it dark room. You just need to put the photo paper in quite quickly. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do two bits. I'm gonna take this photo paper out like this, and everyone's gonna go, oh no, it's fogged, but it doesn't matter with this. What's so magical. And I'm just going to put this one over here with a bit of gaffer tape on it just to show you it going dark with light. Then you take your photograph paper out and you load it into the camera. Yeah, like that. Look, light sensitive. Oh no, quick! So put it in here, quite quickish. And then you'll find that 5 7 photo paper fits perfectly with a one centimetre gap. And that's where the pinhole is. What a lovely noise. Gaffer tape the lid on so it doesn't get half inched or fall to bits. One there, one. Oh, isn't that lovely? You could slow that noise down and sample it. Make it go backwards. What does it sound like? If Peter Gabriel was here, he'd do that. There you go. And there we are. You have your six month duration pinhole camera. You then cable tie it to a drain pipe or post pointing towards the sun. Take the shutter off. And in three months, six months, you point it towards the sun, it's got to be sunlit. In six months' time, uh, you end up with an image of the sun arcing across the sky for how long you put it up for. And rather like has happened here, it all goes dark except for the bit that hasn't been hit by light. You then scan it in, image inverse, uh, flip horizontal on Photoshop, and you've got a six month duration of the sun. And it's clever, isn't it? Thank you very much indeed.